Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. And in today's tutorial, I will show you on how you can use the Signal application. This is a step-by-step -step guide, so you should be able to follow easily. Now, this is extremely simple. All you have to do is to open up your respective application downloader. If you're using an iOS device, you can go ahead and get it from the App Store. And if you're using an Android device, you can get it from the Play Store. Since I'm using an Android device right here, I'll just go ahead and open up Play Store. And inside, you want to go ahead and search Signal. You want to open up this application right here, which is Signal Private Messenger. Go ahead and download the application and open it up. Right after, you will then be taken to the application. You want to hit on Continue, and you want to make sure that you enable all of the necessary permissions, like contacts notifications, sound and more. Right after that, we can now go ahead and register our account by using our phone number. Right after creating your account, you will now be taken to the set of your profile page. You can just go ahead and insert your display. First name and your last name. Right after that, we can then go ahead and change the option to who can find by number you want to click on this option. And if you want to turn it to nobody, you can just go ahead and choose this option. Go ahead and click on save. And if you want to change your profile picture, you want to hit on the camera icon at the profile logo. Right here. If you're ready, you want to hit on the next button. Now you are taken to the create your pin page. Pins can help you restore your account and keep your info encrypted. With Signal, you can just go ahead and insert your password or pin on this tax box right here. Right after that, you will now be taken to the Signal messaging application where you can go ahead and get a new group. Invite friends. Add a profile picture or customize the chat caller. First things first, you want to open up the chats right here. And inside we then have this button. If you want to add a conversation on Signal, you want to hit on this button. And inside, we then have the ability to find users. By their username, find by their phone number. Or we can even add them to our group by sending them an invite. In my case, I'll just go ahead and click on note to myself, right here to go ahead and message myself. In this application, inside, we have the ability to have a conversation and signal. And all of the conversations that you have on signal will be encrypted so all of your messages are safe. In here we also have the ability to send photos. Make sure to allow the permissions through your camera. And we have the ability to send a voice message. If you want to cancel this message, you can just slide the voice. I can to the left. Right after. We can then go ahead and add some notifications or emojis on our messages. You have the ability to add stickers. And you also have the ability to put GIF. Take notes that you can send your gallery. Your file, your contacts or location to this application by clicking on the plus icon. 
if you want to allow the permissions to sell your photos or videos you want to click on the allow access right here going back to the main menu we also have the ability to call our friends so you want to click on the call i can click on the call plus i can and inside you can just go ahead and tap on a friend that you want to call inside signal you also have your stories just like on instagram and facebook as you can go ahead and see i'll click on the signal story right here and if you want to advance to another story you want to click or tap on your screen if you want to skip you want to swipe up and lastly you want to swipe right to exit this is this signal right here if i want to continue i'll tap on my screen and if i want to access i'll go ahead and swipe my screen to the right going back to our conversation you also have the ability to modify this conversations right here to do that you want to hold click on a conversation and inside if you want to unread a specific conversation you have the ability to do so you have the ability to pin messages or conversation mute the notification of this specific conversation you have the archive button and you also have delete if you want to select multiple conversation you want to click on this button right here and we have the ability to unread all of the selected conversations pin the conversations archive and lastly delete and to perceive you want to head over to your settings right here and inside we can then go ahead and see the accounts link devices appearance chats stories notifications privacy and more if you want to change the appearance of signal you want to click on this button right here and inside we have the chat caller or wallpaper we have the ability to change the app i can and you can also go ahead and change the message font size in the dark team or the light team so that is it for our tutorial it is really simple to use it is a messaging app that is really helpful for everyday uses if this video was been helpful for you please consider by liking and subscribing i'll make sure to see you again next time and as always thank you